everybody. My name is Luke Marr and this is Hot Mode. And today on Hot Mode, we are coming to you with a reaction to, of course, Say Yes to the Dress. But this time, for the first time ever on Hot Mode, we're reacting to Say Yes to the Dress India. Yes, because that is a new series. It's a franchise. It's come out. I'm very excited about it. Honestly, I feel like India is taking over the fashion world. I mean, on the runways, we have Rahul Mishra, Sabaya Sachi. At the same time, we have, you know, the new Indian Met Gala. Like, there's a lot going on with the Indian fashion fashion industry and so I'm excited to get into a little bit of a wedding experience because the one thing that I hear is Indians throw a very good wedding. But before we get any further into the video I want to say a huge shout out to today's sponsor who is Factor. Factor makes meeting your nutrition goals easier than ever by delivering fresh, never frozen, dietitian approved meals right to your doorstep. Their team of gourmet chefs create each meal using only ingredients with integrity to help you feel your best all day long. Now, are you too busy this fall to cook, but you wanna make sure that you're actually eating well? Me. Well, with Factor, skip the extra trip to the grocery store and the chopping and the prepping and the cleaning up. Let me tell you, I hate the cleaning up. While still getting the flavor and nutritional quality you need. Factor's fresh, never frozen meals are ready in just two minutes. So all you have to do is just heat and enjoy and then get back to doing your thing, which for me is sitting on the couch and vegetating, fermenting, just existing exclusively there. The other great thing about Factor is you can choose from 35 plus weekly flavor packed fresh never frozen meals that promote a healthy lifestyle and meet your meal preferences all ready to eat in again just two minutes. Now if you're a lover of autumn like myself you can go with fall flavors which is Factor's limited time only hearty comforting meals which do feature seasonal veggies and also styles like cranberry pecan chicken and apple Dijon pork chop. They're just ready in two minutes like those things sound delicious but they sound like they take a lot of time but not with Factor. And the best part is they'll satisfy your fall cravings during the a very busy season without the hassle of having to like make them. And for me, I know that I'm usually very busy running around my apartment during the day and then I often forget to think about what I'll have for lunch. So I keep my energy up with lunch to go. Effortless, wholesome meals like grain bowls and salad toppers that are ready to eat when you're on the go, no microwave required. I genuinely think that not having to leave your home on a weeknight to head to a grocery store because you ran out of carrots is the ultimate luxury. And I really love simple but delicious meals that don't require too much effort after a long day or night, depending on the part of the week. And that's why I love Factor. I can even round out my meal and replenish my snack supply with an assortment of 45 plus add-ons to suit various preferences and tastes. And I can choose from breakfast items like the delicious apple cinnamon pancakes, bacon and cheddar egg bites, and potato bacon and egg breakfast skillets. Or for an easy wellness boost, I love the beverage options like the cold pressed juices, shakes, and smoothies. Factor is now owned by HelloFresh and with a wider array of meal plans to choose from, there's something for everybody. I love switching between the brands and now you guys can also enjoy both brands at a discount with me. So this October, get Factor and enjoy eating well without the hassle. Simply choose your meals and enjoy fresh, flavor-packed meals delivered to your door. Head to factor75.com or click the link below and use code HOTLAMODE50 to get 50% off your first Factor box. Thank you to Factor, and let's get into the video. So let's watch Bride and Mum have completely different ideas on what she should wear. All right, so we're starting off in Mumbai. Okay, Bride or Bridezilla? Oh, which one? Bright chillzilla. Honestly. Yeah, full. Bright chilla I am. Okay. I love a bright chilla. When I actually see Natasha in the outfit that she's going to be wearing on her wedding day, I just hope I don't make a mess of my face over there. Aww. For me, I'm envisioning like a lenga. Kind of like a crop top with like a built-in scarf that runs alongside of it. It usually is like pretty asymmetrical. And then there's a big, long, high-waisted ball gown skirt attached. Sometimes the scarf isn't actually built in. It's kind of like a, a stole or a wrap draped asymmetrically. It's usually in like really beautiful colors. I feel like it makes me elongated a little more. Okay, cute. Thinking proportion. Ivories, neutrals, biscuit, okay. white even. Like I love quiet luxury queen. White. We have no other silhouette preferences like just a sari. Nobody here is hot on just a sari. I, am I not think hot that on. a well worn, beautifully draped sari would also look stunning. I feel like we all kind of know what a sari looks like. It's a beautiful experience. They're usually these really lovely draped dresses, but it's a lot of fabric sort of rolled and draped and tucked and pinned and pulled all together. I'm not sure exactly if they're pinned. So slung sari, the long okay. torso, 
a short blouse, really whatever body fitting, even the sari well draped, and then perhaps a veil to add to that. What I think is really interesting is she's talking about like body conscious body fitting, which I think when we look at American or British to guess the dress, which is what we usually react to, I feel like it's very rare that you hear a mother of the bride say, oh, I would like for it to be body conscious. Normally, it seems like it's usually much more conservative and dressed for the wedding. And you want to make sure that you're not showing off too much because normally it's like in a church and things like that. So it's just interesting to see those dichotomies of what is a mother's expectation of the daughter's usual wear. Also, I'm interested in the fact that they do not do the consultations element in the bridal shop, it seems. It seems like it's done at home. Maybe that differs episode to episode, but it just seems interesting to me that normally when we watch the show, it's usually done like all in the shop. It's very rare that you're in somebody's home beforehand. The lace is lovely lace. Okay. Yeah. Now Shilpa Shetty is maybe three feet taller than Natasha. Shilpa Shetty Kundra is an Indian actress who works mainly in Hindi films. Good to know. All right. She's beautiful. She's stunning. We love that for her, but we don't want anybody to not be themselves. Heart is skipping many beats. Oh yeah. Okay. Not it is pretty. I really do like it. Sexy. Yeah. Yeah. I like the exposure of the, you know, the shoulder know area in okay. the back. I love the drape. I think it complements the body super well, especially sort of the hip area. I love the silhouette on me. I don't know if it's going to be the. Oh my god. Okay, jewelry. I'm loving how it looks on me so far. Wow, she looks beautiful. I also like the fact that it's sort of like this grayish color, grayish tone to it. It's the color. There is no bling to it. There's a bit of embroidery in there. But it's too boxy. I mean, the hip area fits, mother. It's not bridally enough, but like the lace I feel is aging me mm. for some reason. I feel like it's not bringing out a very bride-like vibe. It does look really good on her to be honest. But yeah, the, the gray I thought was interesting. I was kind of a little bit like, hmm. It's not standing out. But not like a hmm, like a hmm. They're different. Let's rework this and come back. All right, so nobody's beefing, it seems, yet. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, this is a lahenga. Correct, because it's the two piece and a biscuit. And this pink, I love this. Oh, I love the little drop crystals. I like the stole. I like also, I feel like it ombres from like the pink into the purple on the stole. It keeps the lace in the stole as well. But now I'm thinking. Mm. Oh no. Look at that purple. I love that, especially the lace. It keeps the lace, which she kind of liked. She said that she liked the lace. She did say she felt like it aged her, but I think it's just the color. It's really different from what you'd see a Parsi bride wear. Mm. Uh -huh. The blouse doesn't seem to be sitting right according to me. It and I feel it's stitched. too revealing. I you feel it like needs to be revealing. at least one inch oh. higher. Not that I'm narrow-minded. She could have worn a much deeper cleavage had it been her sister's wedding. Okay, interesting. I feel like we're getting different vibes here, I Mother. I really like the blouse and I love the work. It really Yeah, I like the off-the-shoulder. Mm -hmm. But I'm just not a fan of the purple. It just didn't blend. It looked very weird. I did not like it. I'm loving this. <laughs> I'm loving it. Okay. I love the purple as well. Yeah. Okay, see? Shayana and me are in the same vibe. Yeah. We're here together. Unique. That's what I like about yeah. it. Yeah, but you're unique right. yourself. You, you don't need Ooh. any more uniqueness. Why? She hit her with a, your personality. I hate doing things per the norm. I want to know if she is an Aquarius. Why don't you tell me what you're liking about mm. this one? The opposite of mom said in terms of it doesn't look like a typical Definitely bridal sari for a Parsi bride at least. Again, contrary to what Tanya thinks, I love the more, the double shade that's going on here, which is the reason why I chose it compared to the other ones because I was like, okay, unique. Hmm. It's a maybe. Oh, okay. But it's also a definitely basis the next outfit. Okay. I could get into this. No, I definitely want you to try this one more look that I feel I could really it. bring it all together. Okay. But really you see like yourself it. in it and then let's... I also, I think I'm gonna really like the Indian version of Say Yes to Dress because they wear a lot of color and I like the color. There's a little bit of dread setting in. I feel like Kush is getting a little oh, no. impatient now. She's almost low-key panicking about maybe not finding an outfit that she loves. So yeah, it's a little bit concerning at this stage Yikes. that they might be Yikes. running out of patience. Oh. 
Oh, I love mm. that. You hit the color palette for Luna. sure. Luna, absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. I can see your excitement. Oh, okay, hot, okay. Hot, I am. Hot. I am. Sorry, like the Indian girlies when they do embellishment cannot be touched literally physically emotionally mentally all of the above cannot be touched like they are on a different astral plane than everybody else the embroidery like look at that little floral pattern sold happy content could die in i would like for that to be the inside of my coffin oh <gasps> ate ate it up okay yeah sold all right all right okay yeah okay oh with the veil oh okay okay Whew. yes yes <laughs> yeah this is what I need. I love the crystal drop, still there. I love the embellishment. I love the veil. Oh my god, the veil. I love it. I'm obsessed. It's beautiful. This sort of light silver, floral embellishment just all over. There's like not an ounce of it that's not covered. A little sheer sleeve, the veil with the embroidery trim. Um, I never get emotional, but no, this, <laughs> she looks beautiful. I felt very nice. Like, yeah, she looks great. I love this. I was getting you feel like this. bridal. Yeah, all of us speechless. Ooh. This is a moment. This is a good way to start. Are you ladies saying yes to the dress? Yes! yes! But what about her? <laughs> Good job, oh. guys. Good decision. Are you saying yes to the dress? I'm <gasps> saying yes to that dress. Congratulations. Yes. I love this show. It's so good. It's so good. Hurrah. Hurrah. We're starting off on the right foot here, people. Next up, we have Bride Wants a Dress that matches her East meets West vibe. If I'm saying this wrong, I apologize. But Divyak, we stand. Style director. So she needs our help in finding a lehenga for her sangeet. Sangeet. Indian wedding tradition. The Sangi, among the many pre-wedding events that occur prior to the Hindu, Punjabi, and Gujarati wedding ceremonies, the Sangeet is where the party begins. The word Sangeet translates to sung together from Sanskrit. Earlier times, the Sangeet would last for 10 days, celebrating up until the wedding day. However, over time, this tradition boiled down to one day function in order to fit all of the wedding events into one week. The Sangeet ceremony takes place two or three days prior to the wedding. The celebration includes dances performed by relatives and friends of the bride and groom, songs by the elder female members of the family, sung in unison with the bride as the focal point, and an open dance floor to commemorate the festivities for the following days. Cute. Okay, so it's like a pre-party. Vibe. When it comes to style, I can be a little picky. Okay. No matter what, I will be wearing Indian clothes. I think I've envisioned myself in a lenga. In, lenga, um, not lehenga. You know, Sorry, apologies. Then reds um, are great. I really do want to bring that East meets West culture. Um, I definitely want to combine a modern with a traditional look or some sort of pizzazz. I feel like they're all intriguing. You know what I mean? Like. They want more, all right? I wonder if it's like a store. Maybe it's not a store. Maybe it's just like a studio. Those Versace sleeves are sleeving. All right, thank you. Thank you. Good luck. Oh, okay, lettuce hem. The girls are serving. Nothing says statement okay. more than all of these beautiful riotous colors. I'm gonna be honest. Just looking at it, not having context, I don't know, and I don't wanna be rude, but like the busts and sleeves are a lot. Dot com. Below that, lovely, beautiful, but... I love the blouse. Honestly, Interesting. the back, this is what I live for. Okay, she's also wearing those sleeves, so like, I gotta keep in context. Oh my God. I'm intrigued. Wow. I do like the skirt a lot, though. Is that a gross grain ribbon? I apologize, everybody, for saying gross grain. But I mean gross grain. Funky, elegant. Classy. Do you want to see maybe a dupatta and yeah, see I how that- Dupatta, I presume, is the sort of stole thing. See, that's beautiful. That I'm sold more on. There's a, a continuity going throughout. Uh, they look stunning in these. I feel it's a little unconventional, the colors, the work. They're like, no, 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 the work is, it's, it's fine. And I'm like, oh. they said, the embroidery, it's okay, I guess. Yes to this dress. Respectfully, the American brides. I'm not going to say yes yet because it's not like 100% ready to go because I still want to see what's out there. But if I left with this dress today, I would be very happy. Okay. Happy for you. <gasps> okay. It's a whole lot of dress, but I don't mind it. Again, that skirt is stunning. I love that. 
and like the gold and the green and the white it's it's not necessarily like my aesthetic not my vibe but like this i think has much more of a continuity to it than the other one the sleeves are something else definitely not me okay like this Kind of bikini vibe, I'm not feeling. I know Sean will not. To see my daughter something in like this is an absolute no. Better without the sleeves. It's more of like if we had somebody come and perform for you, would be. Armbands, not great. As a... Can't hear you, Shivali. She's Speak up. background dancer. <laughs> I love her. Oh, we can't have the main lead looking like a background no, 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 no. dancer. So Shivali, not saying yes to the dress. Oh, absolutely no. not. Mom is not saying oh. yes to the dress. Nani, what do you think about this? Me. I love this her. This dress, I need to feel good in it and I need to carry it. She said I have to sell the garment. And this is a garment I cannot sell and I know myself. Yeah, come on. That's important. I could feel <gasps> different in it. The Langa. Legas. Oh my God. Off shoulder. And so I went with their gut. Yes. And I need this. Wow. I need this in my life. Ah! This is a great show. I'm very happy. I'm very content. <gasps> that neckline, it's giving McQueen the necklace. Yeah. Oh my God, yeah. This is a great show. I don't ever want to watch the American one ever again. Or the English, it's fine. We're good, this is good. The puff sleeve, the neckline. The skirt, I mean, my God, the red with the silver embroidery on it. But I have to ask. That's moment. Yes to the dress. .com. Dot .uk. Yes. I don't know what the Indian dot .com is, but whatever it is, dot. Today I feel so I -N dot .id. I am absolutely overjoyed. I love that. I should also tell you, my love, Aww. that everything you've worn today has been from the pioneers of high fashion in India, from the house of Abu Jani and Sandeep Khosla. Oh, wow. okay, okay, we've talked about them. Congratulations. Yes. <laughs> Goal. Thank this you. is also wow. very smart, I think, for the Indian fashion brands. A, not only because in India, they're very popular, but also outside of. Now we're getting into it, you know what I mean? Sandeep Kopia is very smart because listen, in reality, now you're putting it out to a whole new audience that Abu Jani Sandeep Kosla is a brand that makes looks that are gonna turn it out. .com. Definitely saw all three generations on the couch coming together in this outfit, making me feel amazing. I felt them all in that dress. I felt them all Aww, together. I love that. I'm sold. All right, we got one more. We got one more. I'm excited. Okay, all right, let's do it. <laughs> Next, we have ball gown with huge train wouldn't fit inside of a church. We're still in Mumbai. Now tell me, in terms of your wedding. I also love the home consultation. Is this something you've thought about before? Do you have some ideas in your mind? My mom's gown uh, was from West Virginia. She had worn full sleeves and she looked absolutely gorgeous on her wedding day. Ever since I was 15, 16, I started uh, imagining myself in that gown. My picture is that she should have long sleeves uh, like mine and I want to see myself in her. Controversial a little bit to me. Maybe a hint of blush or, or lavender. When it comes okay. to my sense of style, I like something more modern and edgy over something that's uh, traditional. So I want to wear a ball gown. I'm a ball gown girl. Bridal feel okay. like I'm in a ball gown. I won't get the same. I've tried okay. mermaid fit gown once and uh, I really didn't like it. So I wanted to go for a ball gown. Okay, so not like a fit fit. Like fit it. Here to see Divine and Bridal wear. Extremely excited. All right, we're here already. These beautiful dresses. I would like her to try one of them. And I like that one. Mm. Okay, mom is on it. Mom said, let me read it the It reminds script. me of my wedding. It's got nice M shape over here and a long, nice trail. Okay. Mama's into drama. I'm obsessed with her vibe. The second her mom has entered, she has seen the most voluminous dress in the studio and said, I want that one for my daughter. I'm very excited to try it out. You know, in fact, I always told my mom that I want to try her wedding on and unfortunately, I never got to see it. So Whoa. let's take a trip down memory lane absolutely. and try it on. Yeah, Come absolutely. On. You know, she was doing it for her mom. So I felt like maybe for... Where is it? Mom, reasons, not archiving? Her and get her warmed up. All right, so we're going like more traditional, maybe more Western. I don't want to say more traditional because I don't think that that's necessarily the tradition. Because again, like white dresses, Queen Victoria can't be that traditional to all of India. I think it existed before the British showed up. I'm wondering if this is much more of like a Western inspired experience, but also if there's white Indian wedding dresses that are traditional, please let me know, I'd love to hear. It's pretty, it's very pretty. Oh wow, the back is gorge. Just too impractical. I know Divine loves to dance. Oh my gosh, that's a whole lot of train. Great, I'm obsessed with it, but like, 
It's a lot of train to manage. So Divine, are you saying yes to this dress? This is not me. <laughs> it's great for a Met Gala event. But on okay, if you're going to the Met Gala in that, I'd be happy if it is on theme. On theme. Let's go get you into something that you love now. Absolutely. Okay. <laughs> I was being a little indulgent. Me. There is no uh, space in an aisle uh, for this dress. Yeah, I was gonna say. Maybe for an editorial, but not for church, honey. I'm obsessed with him. Ah, oh, this is really nice. Okay, love that. Embroidery, beautiful, backless. I love the neckline. I like that halter look that it's giving yeah. you. I'm saying maybe to this dress. Not quite there yet. I guess if the people on the couch say yes, then it's a go. And then we ask the bride. I really thought they would like it, but they don't like it and they don't find me looking very bridal. Okay. It's a terrible reaction to hear. New York, that's very bridal. But I think also like wedding traditions are changing. I think there's also now very different aesthetics of a ceremony versus just sort of like getting married at the courthouse. And I don't know if that's a thing in India. I don't really know how that works, but there's all different kinds of aesthetics. So I think it might just not be the aesthetic that they're thinking of for a church. Look at that this color. This is blush. Oh my God. But yeah, I can see, I can see it. It's like a little light pink, but it's still white enough. Without wearing it only, you're getting emotional. This is something that I always really imagined. I wanted to wear a blush gown mm. on my wedding. Cute, I love this. And this is exactly similar okay. to that. Okay, I love thing. Indian say yes to dress. This is my gown. I want oh. to get into this okay. gown. I can't wait to get into it. Come see. <gasps> Aww. I love the neckline. I love the neckline. It's beautiful on her. I love the little, it's like a little cape at the back, swag. The skirt is lovely. The floral embroidery is stunned. Okay, it needs to be fitted a little bit more on the sleeve, but. I say millions time, yes. I love the mom. I'm obsessed with the mom. The mom said, I am doing my acting debut. Just wait, just watch this space. Really beautiful dress. It felt like Bells were ringing, angels were singing, Bells were and the choir was harmonizing. Oh, Just no, it's a sad song. I am falling short of words to say. And it looks... Oh, it looks great now. I would be looking so pretty. In the sleeve area, sorry, the shoulder right. detail from this side looks stunning. It looks so when I it was made for. I dreamt of my wedding dress. Aww. This dress is the first step towards celebrating that. Aww, the mom is so cute. I love her. Feeling exactly what a bride should feel in this dress. Yes to this dress. Yay! That's great. I love that. Divyak, I'm obsessed with you. I stand. Huge fan. It's from Carlio. Oh. They're a brand that specializes in white weddings and bridal couture. Oh, they are dropping uh, these NAM brands, and I'm obsessed. Okay, yes. Hi! <laughs> Hi. Divine, Hi. Leon, Karan. Okay, the one in the tan. Such a pleasure to meet you. Likewise. He's gonna need a sock. You look so amazing, beautiful. you look gorgeous. Thank I hope you. you like the dress. Okay, he's like selling me on boiler suits. I love it. Yay, okay, I love this show. That is Say Yes to the Dress India. I think they're gonna be reacting to that a little bit more because it gives me an insane amount of joy. So let's talk about best and worst. I mean, best, <sighs> there's a lot. Honestly, I think each of the dresses that they picked, really, really beautiful, sold. But also that first one and the last one with the big train, love that. Worst, the sleeve, bikini, top, green, gold, white moment. The sleeves were a little bit much for me. So again, I want to say a huge shout out to Factor. So head over to factor75.com to get 50% off when you use the hot mode 50 code on their website for your first Factor box. So thank you again. I will see you guys in the next video and TTYL.